I, we overthought this LP, I guess. Yeah, a little bit. Uh, to be fair, we would be at tw even if we didn't have the double life thing on, we would be at 26 lives right now, which is still a, a, a metric ton, you know. By the way, I, I really like this soundtrack, like this one right here. This too, the music changed. I think it's pretty good. And uh, see, so you're knocking those bookcases. Can't remember which ones are. Yeah, have the cracks ones on the bottom. Yeah, I, I know that, but I'm still I'm trying to remember exactly what they look like. I know what they look like. Aren't you just a little fabulous little piece of shit? Oh, well, you're gonna use language like, uh, words like that, you know? My words like are... fabulous? Oh yeah, I guess so. Oh, speaking of fabulous, have you ever played a video game called Harvester? No. Oh, okay, never mind then. They have some really fabulous firefighters in that game. Okay. I'm serious, man. Those guys, like, like they make the gay pride move look like normal. It's hilarious. Make it look normal, huh? Exactly. Nobody's gonna get. I, I, no, nobody's gonna get butthurt about that. It's nobody really cares. I don't see why anyone would. I don't know exactly. why people get butthurt over stuff like that. Anyways, you really. Yeah, pretty much. Tumblr. Although, speaking of Tumblr, the whole Tumblr 4chan thing is hilarious. Yeah, I, I, I saw I saw that shit too. Did, did they, didn't, didn't Tumblr provoke 4chan? Oh, yeah. <laughs> why uh, they, why would they do that? Hold on, basically everybody on the internet makes fun of uh, Tumblr. Yeah. And then, like, Tumblr decided that, oh no, we, we still butt hurt now. And then they started trying to do, like, raids, which... You know, completely failed because I think they completely misinterpreted what a raid is. <laughs> well, okay, how do you how do you do anything to 4chan? Because what are you gonna do? Shit post on there? That's what everybody does. No, dude, I remember <laughs> seeing no, no, no. I remember seeing a screenshot of somebody on Tumblr that was like, "My brother left his 4chan account open. I'm going to totally wreck him." <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, um, makes me happy that's, on the inside. That's funny. What, what password have you revealed? Oh, up here. Yeah. Okay. Mike, don't leave your 4chan account open. I won't. You don't know. You don't know who will mess with it. There's a plank over here. Pl a plank where? Oh, on that side. Oh, there. Yeah. Well, there's nothing here that uh, mm -hmm. indicates that that's where we should go. No, and then we're going to go to uh, B and post porn. Oh, okay. Like gay porn, excuse me. Oh. So basically, go to B and basically do, B do like the things. thing that they normally do. Oh, uh, yeah. See, that, that's, you know. that's why I like that site. You know, there's there's just nothing you can do to to stop it. You know. Well, pretty much. It just it's the internet. Exactly. Didn't, didn't some people commit suicide over that stuff? The tumble effect? No, I don't. I have not or heard of anybody. Or did they exaggerate that? That that's probably just sheer exaggeration. Cause they li they like to lie about a lot of stuff on Tumblr, you know. Yeah. Also, you know, maybe maybe we shouldn't talk about this. No, uh, no, no I don't think it's hilarious. Uh, it, no. Go it ahead, is, Mike. Come on, go ahead. I'll, I was kind of hoping you would kill yourself. Yeah, I, I did that before. Oh, you did it, like smart. I, I can... uh, you, You've died to some dumb stuff, like the bombs. Well, this is why we did the fucking double lives. We thought we'd need it, but apparently there's a lot more lives in this game than I remember. All right, so there's a door down there. Remember, we found that this does not matter at all. What doesn't matter? Have it, uh, using the bronze keys. Yeah, it doesn't. But we missed that shit down there, though. Okay, let's just uh, go. Oh, whatever. Oh, we have we have some wisps. Oh, if you haven't noticed, the eyes are now the um, the regular enemy here. Wow, that what? was nice. That was kind of cool. What? That little eye explosion you did. Yeah, that's. Uh, does, I, that does that have a cooldown, or does how, how does no, that I work? I can use it as much as I want. Okay, well I, that's that's just neat. I just use it to slow them down. To it's a utility thing. I don't really need to upgrade it. But well, I mean, I would upgrade it if, if, you, if you have the money. It doesn't do no anything point. against bosses. It's just it's not very effective. It wasn't very useful against the skeleton boss, you know. Hmm. True. Okay, we totally missed a whole fuck ton of stuff down there. Well, yeah, it's kind of the general gist of this little place. We, we just have to go back and backtrack a little bit. Okay, we'll loop around. That's fine. 
And these magic guys are hilarious. That's well, that's why I'll slow them down for you. You know. Oh no, they're no, no, they're funny. I can block their projectile. Again, I can block magical wisp. Oh, oh shit! Fuck no. Oh, fuck that guy. <laughs> Almost got me. I, I, they just, I, it's the green stuff. It fucking just. It blended in a little bit. I'm trying to figure out where he is. Where is he? He's up there. Uh, we can go up. Actually, yeah, we can just do this. Let's keep going this way. There's a golden key in this direction, for one, and it's a dead yeah, end. Let's, let's just kill the butt this blaster. This is a... Oh, whatever. The butt blaster's, like, right up there. And there's these... They're the fire traps. I'm, I'm not sure if you've seen them already, uh, viewer, but I'll explain them to you in a minute. Let me just kill these guys. Yeah, he's dead. Vendor coin and a vendor coin. Okay, anyways, so the thing with these fire traps is that when I go right in front of them, you can actually see where they are. So this one's fine. And we can also kind of like go them into them and laugh. So you can kind of see where the where the path is, but you have to go right in front of the trap, basically. Wish we had gone and gotten that golden key now. Why? Okay, well, fuck, I don't care. And Pat just doesn't care about fire. No, not really. I that's like the, fire. That's the kind of guy he is. You like fire? Well, you'll love the pyro. I actually, I actually was a fan of the pyro. I was more of a babysitter pyro, to be honest. I, I would have taken you more for a medic, to be honest. Um, I did, I did play some medic, but like, I, I felt more, I felt more at home in like an NG nest, to be honest. I think you need to heal, Pat. Oh yeah, oh yeah, dude, totally. Holy shit. It depend. It depend on the map. If it was like, uh, if it was like, uh, what is it? The points one vignette totally would go after the uh, the medic, but just like a uh, what is it called? The one with the briefcase. Yeah, pyro all day every day. Oh, yeah. Nobody plays CTF. The fuck is CTF? Capture the flag. Oh. What? How did I take so much damage there? Did, did they, they burn you, and they explode when oh, they die, so you what, can't stand near them. That fucking hurts. Oh yeah, dude, totally. Why do you think I'm at such low health? I, okay, let's go back down, I'd say. We don't fucking care about this shit. Oh, look, personally, I just kind of want this money. Oh man, wait, 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 wait. Mm. Oh, that felt good. That had to have been satisfying. <laughs> Holy shit. Uh, why are we both so dead? I don't fucking know. It's because I keep running into those fire guys, and I have no reason to. Yeah, well, I'm just kind of digging around and, like, Pat. walking on fire. Pat, look what we missed over there. What? Oh, shit, a coin! <laughs> we gotta walk all the way around for that? Fuck that. Dude, totally. It's a it's a coin! That could be the maker or breaker of this entire run. You don't even know. Legit, son. Legit. Nano machines. How much, how much are those... <laughs> Nano machines. <laughs> Nano machines. Hey, there's, a, there's a button here we missed. How did we miss this button, Pat? Explain this. Um, maybe because this place breaks off at times, and I kind of follow you around sometimes, and that's probably not the best idea. Stop moving. Hold on. Okay, I'm done. All right, so the planks are there, but however, we cannot get over there right now. And we see a level four vitality vendor in the corner there. Oh, that's gonna be awesome, possum dude. Yeah, so the, the vendors here are kind of just scattered throughout, um, which is kind of really random. I don't even know why I upgraded mana. I don't use any really mana intensive abilities. It's actually probably a really total waste. Yeah, for now. Alright. I think we need something stupid to debate about, Pat. Um, how about moderation? How about boxes or briefs? <laughs> Neither. What? Okay, 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 now now I just learned something I didn't really want to know. <laughs> I let it all hang out, Mike. It's like grapes or something. Yeah, okay. Um, changing subjects. What were you talking about? Moderation? What about, <laughs> what about moderation? Yeah, like, uh, like, you know, like, form and, uh, like, admins and stuff. And, like, moderation in, like, a public form, you know? Mm. Okay, so what about that? I, I really don't know. I was kind of hoping you might have something interesting to say, and then we could, you know, spur a conversation from you, that. You, you know, I can't actually talk about that. I really hate some the moderators of 
uh, a certain I website. I think I know exactly of, of what? Of, of, okay, basically, I hate Reddit moderators. Are you talking about the recent post on the one Reddit that we probably both go to? Uh, n that, not that in particular. I think I know what you're, oh yeah, yeah, I know what you're talking about now. Yeah. Uh, yeah. no, I'm not, I, I don't have, it's Ziggy D, and I don't have anything specifically against him, but, uh, I, I really don't like the fact that a lot of, like, okay, unfortunately, um, I don't know if anyone knows my opinion on, on Reddit. I don't really like Reddit all that much, and it's mostly because... I like it because it's a source for me to get local, like, news, but I don't like the community in terms of how it's, like, self-righteous a lot of the time, and the, the pitchforks and stuff, because I, I just could not give half a fuck about, like, the pitchforks and stuff. I made I made my opinion around that a long time ago, like, I, I just... Oh, later, Pat. No, shit. I, I actually, I totally stumbled into it by accident. You want to do this one? Actually, it doesn't fucking matter. Yeah! You can have that. You can have the juice. I lo fucking love the juice. I- it Basically, the witch hunts and the fact that there's a- there, It's a lot of hive minding. I basically. hate hive mind so fucking much. I want- I, I prefer to make my own opinions about stuff and not just have, like, the- Like, the most unpopular opinion gets, you know, the, to the top or- You know, it's like, oh, oh, Origin isn't that bad. That's a good distribution service. No, I've made up my own mind about that. But it's just like, oh fucking hell. The, the people, like there's no differing opinions. It's a fucking echo chamber and I hate I hate sites like that so much. I, I don't- There's a like necromancer or something up there and he oh. wrecked my shit. Oh, he's dead now. Okay, good. I, I really hate echo chamber sites basically. And, yeah. the, and the moderators I find a lot of time, like, try to basically make it more into that. A lot of the time, you know, they, they try and bring also their own like standards into it when it should be like, let's say, let's say it's a site like a, a, a something about, I don't know. Oh, well, uh, for example, on the Door Fortress Reddit, which is a relatively, Door Fortress itself is a relatively small community. I made some, you know, as far as me personally, I have to think some very actually successful, very, very informative Door Fortress tutorials. And I decided to post those up on the Dwarf Fortress Reddit, thinking, you know, this is a good idea. People might be interested in this, because it had a lot of information in it. And then the mo one of the moderators was also another YouTuber, who we were getting shit on, was another YouTuber who made videos, and he removed mine because he was the only one who was allowed to post Dwarf Fortress videos on the subreddit. Yeah, and that's abuse. It's it's total abuse of that kind of shit. I want to I wanna see Careful. Oh, yeah, you're right. Okay. Okay, good. I, I want to see uh, I want to see a site with differing opinions and stuff like that. I like I like seeing because I don't have one opinion. My opinions change, you know, given yeah. certain certain circumstances, things like that. You know, and I, the influx of new information. Yeah, like I, I don't really I'm not the kind of person who just kind of goes like loyal to one thing. Like you know uh, you know I'll give you a good example of that, guys. Um, I used Google. to f I used to fuck it. No, well yeah, Google's one of them. I hate Google <laughs> now. <laughs> I used to love them and now I hate them. Uh, but also my opinion on DLC, like, there was a time I said, you know, I fucking hate DLC, I'll never buy and stuff like that. Now I've kind of got more interested into it, mostly because the quality has changed, especially for some games that I really enjoy, you know. Um, and, you know, like, something like Payday 2, like, they have, like, $5 weapon packs. Not too into the weapon pack stuff, like, model, but still, I, I put money into it. Uh, occasionally, you know, I'll put money into this stuff, and that's what I mean, you know. Like, I, I did, before I was t just totally anti against it, like, I, whenever I saw it, I'd be like, oh, fuck that noise, you know, and then I kind of just, I changed my opinion. It depends on the pricing and what it paid. What the fuck was that? Uh, that's a, the, the thing on the ground. The, oh, the, the purple ball. No, the poo guy. Oh, the purple ball? I have no fucking idea. Oh, shit, there's no way I'm going to reach that guy. Like, he's behind a bunch of walls. It did, for me, on the DLC, it depends on the quality and actually what it adds, you know? Like, weapon packs are literally retarded and cancerous, but... Well, they, you on know, the other the, hand... The, the Payday 2 ones aren't actually that bad. They're actually kind of, you know, they're, they're fun enough that I would I would pay money for them, you know? I And and they had a one big high save released for that game, and it was like 7 bucks or something. So, you know, it's not awful. 
I think it's still a little bit overpriced, but it's at the point where I'm actually. I mean, five dollars is a bit much for just a group of weapons. I uh, well, yeah. It's sometimes well, see, it's like I wouldn't. Stuff, I don't mind weapon packs as a thing, but if it's if it's like uh, like like a dollar for like uh, like three or four weapons, yeah, fine, whatever. I, I can do. It. I'm probably not gonna buy it, but I'm not gonna be bothered by it. But five dollars just seems excessive. Oh, well, you know, a lot of the time, I, I think that new games are a lot of the time too expensive as well. You know, so. It depends on the it depends on the platform and the developer. I know How Origin scouts matter? like a motherfucker. Oh yeah, the games are seventy seventy dollars right now. No, uh, for Canada, just because I'm just because I'm uh, Canadian like maple syrup. They're they're racist. <laughs> exactly. Motherfuckers, honestly, all of them. But you know, I as I said, for me, it's they're they're pocketing. Oh wow, Pat. Yeah, the blue ones hurt a lot when they explode. I'm gonna grab this. Hold on. You're having a lot of trouble here. It's because we're. I, 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 I'm losing focus. Oh, because we're talking about like all this talk about EA and stuff is making you furious. Yeah, I know. My blood is boiling. Yeah, now I'm kind of worried about this. Yeah, hold on. Um, I'm going back for a second. Is you? Is no. you? No. Is you? Um, kind of thought there might be a secret secret top thing over here, but maybe not. One of those secret type things? Yeah. Instead of avoiding traps. And just letting the eyeballs get hit. <laughs> yeah, I got that guy. Yeah, got... I'm not dashing into those eyeballs anymore. And you, just as you say that, I know I exactly know. what you did. I know, <laughs> I know. Okay, God. I looked at him and I hit the button and I remembered what I said and I was hoping <laughs> you wouldn't say anything. You're as bad as I am when it comes to words. Except I'm not what I am. Except for the times that I'm not, because sometimes yes. You see, anyways, back on the subject of moderation. Um, you know, I I want to me an ideal site would be one that you know. Like, like, I like the forum kind of a system where, like, you know, open opinions and stuff like that. And I kind of like that. I wish, I wish there was more. You know what I hate? Upvoting and downvoting shit. Like the like system, which, goddamn, I think is one of the most obnoxious things to come onto the internet in a long time. Actually, you know what? I read, um, I read uh, Hacker News, which is a, a site for. Uh, it's kind of like basically Reddit, except it's for entrepreneurs and. Uh, uh, like tech and geeks. It's basically what like Reddit used to be when it was about tech and stuff and dig to to some extent. That's why I really like it. Wow, that guy just fucked you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They do that. Um, and Hacker News, uh, what their system is there. is you can only upvote until you reach a certain karma threshold, and then you can downvote. So they literally don't give you like any account. And there's like people, like uh, whoa, they're firing their little green balls at me. Uh, they have a very good system about it, and there's actually a lot of good quality comments on, on Hacker News, actually, in terms of tech stuff. Handle the eyeballs, I'll handle him. Oh. See, he's dead, by the way. Yeah, I, I noticed. Hacker News is a really good system, it's just the... the I think the engine that it runs upon, the, 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 like the actual site itself, is actually really antiquated, and it's like tables and... Not very no. good for mobile and some stuff like that. That's why I don't really like that site too much. But eh, well. I wish there was a site like Hacker News that was for like more local stuff and gamings and whatever else. And I oh, I just ate one of your apples. I noticed. <laughs> no, you ate a bomb. And, and 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 a and a bomb too. I did that as well. Oh, we don't have a key for this. It's probably down here somewhere. Spike on the ground. Oh, an exit has been revealed. Spike. Yeah, I know it's a spike. There's a stake up there. There's a stake in my boot. Damn it! I got hit by a, I got hit by the spike thing because I was trying to adjust my uh, my orientation. Right, okay, he's dead. Thank God. Go eat the steak. There you go. Uh, seventy-five fucking hell. You're for real, God. Yeah, and doesn't even really put a too much of a dent in my health bar either. Oh, uh, we want to go down there and get that silver key. Yeah. You go get that. I'm not walking all the way around. Fuck that. Bike uh, on the ground? 
You know, we can oh no, we killed the guy up there. Hey, look at us. I don't know. Doing things in the right order for once. Oh, now I'm on fire. Yeah, because you walked into him while I was in his death animation. Okay, well, let's see what's over here, and then we're gonna go to the Vitality Vendor, maybe. Oh, here we go. Oh, uh, this, this opens it up, actually. Uh, no, let's go back. Sorry. Or, Hold on. Alright. Because, um... Fuck, dude. Now that you've unleashed the swarm... God damn, those balls hurt. Or whatever the fuck yeah, they, they're kind of they're kind of pretty bad, actually. All right, let's go back to the vitality vendor up there. I could use oh, some more health. Health is nice. I still really like the music in this game. Mm. Amazing. Right. You know what? You gotta admit that a lot of smaller and more pixel-based games actually do have some really good music. Move speed and health. Oh yeah, I'm gonna fucking go fast, Pat. You can't stop me. I haven't gotten any of the boost speed upgrades. That's because you're dumb. I don't have a dash. Yeah, well, you're dumb, then. You oh. get, that dash is for your healing. Alright, there's wait, two- Wait, what? There's two things here. Oh. Uh, actually, wait, we can go up here. The fuck? Oh, well, I forgot the plank. Oh, there's, there's a plank, yeah. What the fuck's the point in this place? Whatever. Hey, wait. What? Oh, area just filled. Oh, just wait. Feet. Yeah, I get it. No, the reason this is blocked off is because this is before was where we uh, we entered. Is it? Yeah, that, that, that's why it's blocked off. It was from the boss. Oh. All right, let's go this way then. I, I, I know something felt weird about that, and I couldn't put my finger on it. Yeah, you can't put your finger on a lot of things, Pat, as we've learned. Yeah, my fingers are too fat for that, but, you know, Naluri never disagreed. Oh, okay. <laughs> I like how you just like, oh, okay. <laughs> I don't know, what, how do you follow that up? I don't, I don't know. Yeah, exactly. It's like you do it on purpose. All right, well, you, of course. Did you find the, the butt blaster? Uh, yeah, I'm killing him right now. All right, this He's is dead. A, this is a wisp well right over here, and I destroyed it. But I'm, I'm just telling you what that was. You know, these games totally copied Wisp from Dota 2, I'm just saying. Yeah, they totally did when Everything rips off Dota 2. I know! You know that game League of Legends? That really ripped off Dota 2. I cannot believe don't, it. Don't start that! <laughs> Holy shit! That's like opening up a can of worms the size of Quebec. Okay. It's my job to make everybody angry. Oh they, my god. They should know I don't care about MOBAs that much. No, holy shit. Oh no, you like Dota. I, don't know. I, I like it, yeah. I don't play it a whole lot. Right now. Or any. Yeah, well. Yeah. I, I got too many games to play. What am I supposed to do? That's true. You know, playing, like, playing the free to play games is like. Yeah, I'm playing that game called Hammer Watch. Exactly. The newest praise. I'm, I'm Dude, kinda... The fact that they added like a, uh, a mod workshop for this game makes me happy because adding a mod workshop for a game automatically boosts its sales. You know what? I was I was all for GOG, and then you can have the orange, and then what? Uh, what was I gonna say? I saw a game on being sold on GOG that that looks like fucking shovelware. Like I don't even know how it got approved, and it's basically <laughs> it's basically like like Steam Greenlight times like one thousand that game. Like, I, I I, have a better mic quality than the guy that made the game and did the voice acting for it. I don't know what the game is called, but it looked, just knows really, really terrible looking. And I, I'm surprised that it got what on GOG. I, okay, I don't remember. It was just the trailer got, like, if you look on GOG's channel, if you're really curious. Was it, was it a new game or was it an old game? I linked it to you the other day. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, wow. Uh, there's Butt Blaster, unless you got him. No, you didn't. Oh, no, I did not. Ow. Alright, let's go get him. It, w it was a new game. Um, I don't oh, know, shit, but- I'm stuck in that corner. It, it, it was like, disliked a whole fuck ton, basically. On- on- I don't on remember you site. linking me that at all. You even said something after I did. No, you linked me some, like, green light shit. Yeah, and that was from GOG. Yeah, but I didn't know it was that game. I should- I didn't actually look at it. Oh, nice. Sorry. Nice, Pat. Yeah, well. You know, I was very busy at the time. Wow. I kind of just took what you said at face value, like, oh, GOG Greenlight? Cool, they're becoming more like Steam. No, I'm like, it's like a Greenlight game, and it was really bad. 
Well, you know, you can't say green light games on Steam are really that bad. They actually have pretty high quality. I mean, that's where Risk of Rain... Like, what the fuck was that? A purple ball. By the way. Like, Risk of Rain came from Steam Greenlight. I'm not saying they're all bad, I'm just saying... No. Pretty sure this game did too, actually. Oh, this one's good. Did it really? Yeah. Well, sometimes sometimes they're good, it's just they're, they need to get on Steam somehow, but... Uh, by the way, let's get this ones. down here. Early Is access, it? actually, that's the word I was looking for. Early access. I fucking hate early access. Yeah. I've seen games on Should Steam. Should I even bother coming just... down there? No, not really. Okay, I'm gonna just watch okay, that. Okay, maybe. Maybe. Yeah. Oh, Pat's dead. Reap Holy you, you crap. Know, you know you had a potion, right? No. Oh, now I'm dead too. Because they, <laughs> they, they fucking wreck me. Yeah, they do me too, actually. But you could block it. I can't block that. Oh my god. That okay. green projectile, I cannot block. Let's find an offense uh, vendor, please. I'm gonna go wreck him. No, no, no. Let's get him. No, no, I'm gonna wreck it. Pat. I led them into spikes. <laughs> wow. <laughs> fuck those guys. No, seriously, fuck those guys. Like, I'm just gonna grab all this money. Just go do what you need to do. No, I'm, go I'm gonna come down there and watch you. And breathe really heavily through the wall. <sighs> I I'm like that guy's green light game now. Oh, God. <laughs> That's how bad it was, though. Yeah, I guess I might as well go open the door here. Maybe. God, those, those necromancer guys are horrible. Yeah, I know. I know. My shield is very inconsistent, by the way. Yeah, I've noticed that. A, a passage has been revealed. Boy, howdy, that's descriptive. It's a passage. Just one. We only have to go yeah. one, and it's down there. It's How do you know, though? Oh man! Now I remember there was a there was a riddle of the Sphinx here. Is there, Mike? You want to know what I think the riddle is? What? I'm here. I'm here. You're just gonna dash your way through it. And oh yes, and you just fucking face tanked it. Yeah, it's something I would never do in a million years. <laughs> um, come up to. You know what? I'll just hit the buttons. Who cares? I'm coming up to nowhere, actually, because I don't see it anywhere. Basically, there's a key there that you can see. I can't go there, because I'm not... Yeah, there's a passage that led from the top from where we were before into this area. I'm not filthy paladin scum. Fuck you, Mike. Paladin for life. Also, I mean, death thrive. You died? No, 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 no. I'm getting close to it. Uh, I'm just gonna finish up over here, you know. Mm, okay, but well, that, that's good. Well, look how much money! Going. Look how much money I have. Ten thousand. Are you gonna retire with all them shekels? Mm, I would only need twenty-five schmeckles to sort to you know to do what? that. But so yeah. You're gonna retire with twenty-five schmeckles. Yes. God, I can't even buy you and have her watch Happy Meal, man. Oh, uh, there's a butt blaster. Yeah, but you can get some big fake boobies with twenty-five schmeckles, and that's all you need. Really? Yeah. Oh. I won't question your masculinity, I promise. Well, thank you. Like, have you just ever wanted to sit there and then just, like, have you just ever imagined if you had a pair of breasts? No. I, I can't oh. say that I have. Oh, okay, never mind then. It, I, I bet it's the same as when, like, you know, like, women sit there and, and think about what it's like to have, like, big muscles, you know? It's probably or the same way. Penis. Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, I'll do it.